eight degrees in here. It's much colder outside and uh, the batteries are really, really cold. So we got two 1500 uh, watt heaters going on here. One's a, a ceramic one, the other's an oil field. Got them uh, plugged in, pulling power and kind of doing a test here and it's really pulling the power and uh, the system is really knocking out the juice um i had it unplugged it so it will uh because it was just too cold to run anything proper uh the batteries would run out of juice pretty quick so i just came out here and just kind of powered the main thing down but the solar kept uh charging the batteries up so the batteries are pretty solid and, and full so John came out here and uh, we're just kind of taking a look see what's going on and this is what we're doing so right now uh, we're putting out a little heat and uh, seeing what the system can do all right guys as you heard uh, kind of worried about the system because we're still waiting for electrician to show up and we can able to do um, some stuff here so Dave was kind of a little bit scared because he had the batteries sitting here. He can't put this one down at the basement, so he covered them up. And uh, the solar is just doing a little trickle charging thing. So what the system is pulling right now, if you calculate here, look at 130, 136, 138 at 30.5. If you do the calculation, we are pulling approximately four, over 4,000 watts. This inverter is a 4,000 watt 24 volt and look what we pull in right here it's a lot of amps because this little heater is a 1500 this ceramic one is a 1500 watt so they can't just run um, over 1500 max they run you know it's pulling up heat so they they tend to work you know after a while they disconnect and go back like a relay like thermostat. starts so Grimeister Dave kind of worried about the batteries. I'm worried too because the, the electricians are all booked and the solar was just doing his thing, you know, during the day. So Dave is kind of worried, don't want to put too much load into the system right now till uh, we got um, everything. You're going to get all everything tied into the system. That's the, that's the word uh, in the house. Well, the electrician is going to show up and uh, trying to disconnect everything again so he doesn't want that so he decided just to run a little bit loads here but the batteries are freezing cold so what he did he covered them up here he's worried about them i was worried too i was like why didn't you just run the system so well it's we already booked for electrician so this is what it is so i came down just checking on the, the system and uh he's holding up the batteries are charged and uh, we get them all running. So put those two loads here. And they are still just ramping up with all the cold. You know, there's a lot of stories. People say the batteries can't handle that cold. But the cold in this room, man, I can't feel my fingers right now. It's way too cold. It's way too cold. So Dave is just, he it, 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 it don't want to use the heaters on this thing. You know, so that they can run all night because it's a heavy duty pulling this kind of power. Trying to run a place like this, it's not insulated. Look at this. Yeah. So it's going to be hard on the system. It doesn't matter how much batteries you have, you're going to be draining them so quick because it's pulling constantly 136, 138 amps. That would be a lot of power. But I just want to assure Dave that the batteries are okay because he's worried. So they still performing. We already run almost uh, what over 10, 10, 15 minutes. Yep. Well, we still want to do that and reduce the power a little bit, and uh, the solar is going to be doing some other charge. But right now, to be honest with you, we are not doing any good. This room is cold, and the gar sorry, this garage is cold. We just want to make sure we do some tests that the system is running, and so that they will be rest assured. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is the update at 10 degrees in the garage and the system still running. So this is what it is. This is the first time Dave has heard the, uh, fan, kick the off. fan kick off on the system. I told him about that before, but he wasn't sure because the loads we were running, this 1500 watt we tested, 
the system didn't even cough. No. But the no. minute we plugged both of them in, and the minute I plugged both of them in, and all of a sudden the system kind of really went, oh, and then the fan really kicked in, John was like, holy cow. Yeah. Listen to that fan. It's yeah. really pushing out the power. Look at that. Still holding. Uh, that amps is pulling. That tells you the power of lithium. Still holding the, the, the voltage. Very cold, but it's holding the voltage constantly. So, he doesn't want to leave. I don't want you guys to think he abandoned the system just to leave the system. I know all, some of us are. I was freaking out too because I was like, hey, <laughs> I thought you put it inside. He said, well, I just... I just leave it here from the last time we left here. This, that's, that's it. I was like, okay. But I know the system will survive. That would just tell you that your system can still be on a cold barn or somewhere. The system works. Take this from Grillmeister Dave. It has been cold in Minnesota for the past year. And tomorrow is going to be worse. Yeah. Tomorrow we're going negative six degrees. Yeah. In certain areas. Well, I'm just talking about my area. But look at that. It's over six minutes run now on this video. We've been testing before. I said, oh, let me grab the camera. But look, we're still pulling. We're still sitting at 30.4. So 134, 136, 38. That's what the run. And the system is doing some stuff, though. It's kicking. Well, I just want to report to you live here at Greenmeister Dave's house with the JW Solar USA. I decided to stop in the evening so that it can be rest assured and we, so we want to test the system he told me that he disconnected i was like what did you do so i decided to come down and take a look for myself make sure he didn't destroy his investment and we are well rest assured now right sir yes all i did was unplug uh, all the power cords we had set up through my house and unplugged it from the wall and the only thing it was doing was the solar was coming in trickling in and keeping the battery topped off that's all I did was unplug everything else throughout the house. That's all I touched. Okay. Well, guys, take this from Grillmeister Dave. Learn from Grillmeister Dave and experience and just um, test. Experiment. That's the word I was going to use. And we are still running here. And it's late evening now. It's approximately 6 something here. But the system is kicking. So, look, we're still seeing. 30.4 at seven minutes I started recording, but we were running it before that. It's even flicking to 30.5. So look how stable it is. Wow. Alright guys, take care. Love you guys. Subscribe and share to the channel. Share our videos. Live from um, Grimmeister Dave, JW Solo USA. Thanks for watching.